Alright guys, welcome back. Uh, MC Crawl here. Alright, today I'm going to go through uh, a few tutorials on just basic uh, control units and T flip flops and stuff you would use before you actually get to what your the actual mechanisms, uh, you know, the powered units. So, uh, I'm going to go through a few of these. The first one I'm going to go through is my control unit, uh, which I have nicknamed uh, Roku for reverse order control unit. Um, and this is what we're going to do. Uh, you place blocks, every other block, from each other in a single channel row. Like so. Then, from your power source, We'll call this our power source, this block right here. Uh, we will put repeaters facing out the directions from the block. And then, when you get to the end, you want to go uh, in reverse. So you want to go on to the next uh, section of blocks, and then go in the reverse order, uh, reverse direction. Now, these torches are just to represent the order that they're in. Keep in mind that when a block is powered, the torch goes off. So that block, therefore, would be powered. Let me get a switch. You know, I should put this in front of us. All right. Okay, as you guys can see there, they turned off almost instantly, but then came back on in from left to, uh, or came back uh, turned back off from left to right uh, really quickly. Now, what we want to do at this point is so that we can control the, each unit that we need powered or unpowered um, is we got to set timing. Um, these timings are really of no importance yet. Uh, you can change those. You'll find needs for those eventually, I'm, I'm sure. Um, every once in a while, I actually do use them. Uh, but we want to change these right here. The most common is 3. It gives you a good time, especially if you're trying to do something like a block exchanger. You want to give it time so that when a piston moves forward, that the another piston has, another, has uh, a chance to push the block in a different direction. Um, two works well, but for uh, SMP servers, I highly suggest three. Um, and that is pretty much the tutorial for the uh, Roku. All right, guys, um, this is going to be on my for on the um, YouTube channel, so that whenever I'm referencing my control unit, I'll reference it as Roku, and I'll put a link in the uh, description to uh, this video. Alright guys, thanks for watching.